Okay, hi my loves. Okay, so um I am going to be doing full cover gel tips today. Now these I actually primed them already a while back because I was going to do my nails and they ended up being a flop with what I wanted to do. So we are going to do everything Eno Couture because when I tell you I have everything to do nails with Eno Couture, I actually do. So let's move this stuff out of the way. And honestly, these nail clippers are my absolute favorite. Like even my fiance has a pair um, to keep his nails trimmed down because they're super sharp. I love that they are straight and they're actually heavy duty. When I tell you, I have bought, um, you know, uh, professional nail clippers and heavy duty ones and they all break over time. Like they, they don't last. So, um, and with these, they're just a couple dollars. They're like so much better, I'm telling you. Like when I tell you, I have everything. And then his cuticle pusher is actually like nice and sharp. So be careful. I have actually accidentally cut myself. It was my fault. Like I don't, you know, blame him at all because it is nice and sharp. And I wasn't paying attention and I was trying to do like two things at once. And I like slipped and like cut my skin a little bit. So, um, it had nothing to do, you know, it was just my fault. It's, I'm not blaming anyone for my F ups. I don't know exactly what I'm doing today. I kind of want to do like a crocodile type of nail, but I'm not sure yet. Because the only thing, I want to do everything Eno Couture, and I don't have Blooming Gel. I don't have Eno Couture's Blooming Gel. I actually don't know if he has Blooming Gel. So that might actually be one thing that I have to use from another company. But we shall see if I'm going to end up doing it or not. You know? And since I don't have his e-file, I am going to just be hand filing because I don't want to really use anything else. This is dedication to the fact that I am an ambassador now. And I'm excited for the fact that I actually use his products. You know, I'm not just like starting to buy his stuff now. Like, no, I am deep into his products. I have been buying it for over a year now. Um, I've never had nothing but great vibes coming from him. He's always been super nice. And he, um, I'm not gonna lie. I mean, the one time a bottle came broken within like three days, I got a new bottle. Like it was fast, fast shipping within 24 hours. They emailed me back and within three days I got a new bottle. So like, I, I don't, I mean, I can't speak for everyone's, um, experience i can only say what i have experienced i've not taken away from anyone else's experience but for me i always record myself and take pictures when i'm opening new products and when i email them i always send evidence because you have to realize that there are scam artists out there that will lie and try to connive their way into getting free products so you have to understand as a business owner you have to be weary of people you know like i don't understand why people think that that's okay to scam um but it's not okay so anyways i am going around and just you know taking the shine off of my nail i'm just trying to where are my little nippy nippies? I can even use scissors, I guess. Oh, nope. There they are. I got my nippers. I mean, when I tell you I have everything Eno Couture, I do. So, like... And they're super sharp and so nice. If I tried to clip this off with, let's say, these, <laughs> it would not work. Like, they just aren't sharp. They don't... They just... They're just not sharp like i had to like pull it off now with these i could literally just go in right and actually look at that look at that 
Like, it actually cuts it off, okay? It actually cuts. Like, there really is a difference in quality. You just have to realize that. I want to do these really nice, so... I really want to clean up the cuticles. Let me make sure you're actually seeing this, because y'all know... Yeah, okay. I just want to make sure y'all are seeing what I'm doing here. And don't worry about this one. I had actually, you know, messed up that nail. And um, it's finally, like, growing back a little bit. But it is very important to get nippers that are nice and sharp because... Uh, you do have to be careful with them because they are nice and sharp, but you're not hacking at your fingers trying to pull off skin. It cuts it right off for you. So you're not messing up your fingers, you know? That's important. Okay, but how are you guys doing? So if y'all haven't known, then my TikTok got taken away which sucks, but I'm starting over. And, you know, I kind of was being put in this box of only doing nails. And I actually don't want to just do nails. I'm really starting to fall in love with makeup. Maybe it's like BoxyCharm getting in my head. Um, but I'm starting to really get into makeup and actually wearing makeup more often. So I kind of wanted to... Um, make my channel more, you know, I, I started a diet, so I'm going to start keeping track of that on the channel. So maybe it was a blessing in disguise, to be honest, you know? So I'm not going to get all sad about it and depressed. Does it suck that I pretty much lost almost 20,000 followers? Yes, it truly does. I worked hard for those followers. Um... But at the end of the day, it is what it is, and I'm not going to whine and cry about it because if TikTok's not going to give it back, they're just not going to give it back. There's nothing I could do, you know? So I'm just going to continue on and um, gain new followers, you know? So it is September. Oh, my siding is finally done. I'm getting like new lights and I have a new new light for the front porch, new mailbox. Um, just doing all that little cutesy stuff. Doing a little bit of uh, finishing up the remodeling and all that kind of stuff. So, mm -mm 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 -mm. so you want to make sure that all the shine is off. Now, I usually um, put a base layer. Oh, do I actually have? Oh, this, this actually might not be all. Oh, I think I do actually have. Okay. Yes, I do have base gel. I'm about to say, I might have to lie here and say that I'm doing all Enel Couture stuff. No, I'm just joking. Y'all would obviously see. But I would pretty much be calling myself a liar. Because I said in the beginning of the video that I would do nothing but Eno Couture products. So, we, sh we shall see. I think it's going to be like 99% of Eno Couture products. I mean, like, come on. It can't be. I'll try to do everything Eno Couture. How about that? How about that? I will try my best to do everything. So far, it, it's all Eno Couture stuff. You know, because I do have a lot of his products. Um, But, I mean, I even have his Dap and Dish. Like, I have pretty much everything. But there are a few things I guess I don't have of his. So, you know. 
Alrighty, so I just want to make sure I'm piercing. Do, 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 do. So you want to make sure, you know, you push your cuticles back and get all that um, gunk out. Let's see if I could do left hand. Okay. But, um, so my new Galaxy Z Flip, it was getting a little hot. I'm not going to lie. Um, when I was using it a lot, trying to upload video, do anything like that. So I had to go get it, um, diagnostically checked and stuff like that. And they said that um, it was just overheating a little bit, like an error popped up, but it's not, it's something that like pretty much will get fixed with like the next update. So I'm not worried about it. I just wanted to make sure that Galaxy knew. Um, so maybe that is something that they could fix in their, you know, make sure that they do fix in their next update and they could uh, have it. Cause, um, I called Galaxy and they pointed me in the right direction on who specifically to go to. So I went there and like I said, they plugged it in. Now you wanna make sure you only take off dead skin. You do not want to take off anything live because you will bleed and that's actually technically, uh, you're not supposed to do that as a nail tech. You do not cut live skin. It's only like dead skin that you're allowed to cut. I know that there are those Russian manicures and all that kind of stuff, and that's cool for them. They're in another country. You guys have to make sure you pay attention to the laws and rules of your state and anything that's federally um, legal and illegal, okay? So just because something is done out of the country, you know, because I, I, I tend to follow people that's like, you know, from the UK a lot and other countries. So you kind of like um, get misguided a little bit because you don't realize that their rules could be a little bit different than ours. So just be careful with that, you guys. Um, just be careful, that's all I gotta say. Cause you might be going about doing things that is illegal for your state. And you know, it's not really worth getting in trouble for. Boom. <sighs> I shall clean those after. Alrighty, so now I will take a little bit of alcohol. I don't want to use my swipe because I said we are only doing Eno Couture products. And this is just a no name. This is just, you know, alcohol. So I don't want to use swipe or anything like that. I'm just using a basic alcohol to just get all the dust and get all the gunk out. Okay. And I love the fact that these are pink. The only problem that I have is that once you start using them, you know, you could kind of see uh, the dye or the color, you know, the pink in. But whatever i mean it does it really matter not really all right let's get all this up all righty so the next thing that i cleaned up my nails the next thing i'm going to do is prep and prime so okay i cleaned up my nails now it's prep and prime time And this doesn't really, I mean, it just smells like chemicals. It's not like really harsh or anything, but. OK. 
Okay. But um, anyways, I've been kind of taking a break. There was like just drama with you know, I mean, um, with uh, Anna acrylics and getting you know my TikTok taken away, and I mean that was a result after the fact that she had so many bullies coming after me, and uh, pretty much kept reporting my page and stuff like that. So it just kind of sucks, you know, um, that it happened. And that TikTok allowed it to happen, but, you know, it's whatever. What are you going to do about it? I will get more followers again. And I thank anyone that has followed me on TikTok. I do appreciate doing it again, you know. But I do have a BoxyCharm that I have to open up so after i do my nails i'll be doing another video of my boxy charm for the month and it's probably just my base box because i have the base and the premium so okay second coat I always do two, you know, I'm a heavy lifter, so um, I just like to do two just in case, you know, it's better to be safe than sorry. I love these bottles too, like they're so freaking cute. Like, look at that bow. I love, I've always loved this product and I was a little hurt when, I mean, I didn't know he was actually doing ambassadors. Um, but I was a little hurt that I wasn't in the first rounds, but you know, I was kind of so consumed with TikTok and stuff like that, that I wasn't really uh, watching videos. Um, so that's probably why also. Okay. So the next thing that you have to do right after you prep and prime, this is pretty much what you do, no matter what type poly gel, gel, acrylics, whatever. This is what you have to do no matter what you're doing so now we're gonna do a base coat on the nail but what we're going to do is um we're going to put this in the light and actually cure this layer but we will be putting more on the nail but the next round will not be cured okay all righty and if you feel like you're if it's burning a little bit just creep your fingers into the light instead of um just going in and putting it in there my fingers aren't bad, so I'm good with it. I'm trying to think, should I use my gummy gel to attach these? I might use the gummy gel instead of using like the other gel. Let's see. I'm trying to think, should I, which one should I use? I have gummy gel and the pink gel. I have both of them, like the squeezy. I think he said that this stuff works better. Instead of the pink. Hmm. What should I do? I want to try the squeezy. Let's try that. Maybe I shall do the pink next time. How about that? So we will do that. Squeezy. All right. Cured. Boom. Now, next hand. Make sure you don't like flood it and get it like on the cuticle or anything like that. I'm trying to think if I want to do a two layers. No, I don't think I need to do two layers. 
It's just that my nails are flat, so when I use these, I have to really fill them in with product so that they actually um, fill up. But I love, I'm kind of starting to get more into these. I used to only, like, I've only done them a few times, but I started, like, liking them more. Just because when I get lazy and I don't want to do my nails, like, this is so much easier. You know, this could just be a last second. Ooh, this one actually burned a little bit. So, like I said, go in a little bit, like, creep in there. And you could do the, there. Um... But this could be a last second thing. You don't have to take out all your acrylics and monomer and stink up the house. You could actually really throw these on and put a nail polish on and boom, out the door. Uh, or gel polish, you know what I mean? Like you don't have to sit there and sculpt and, and use forms and everything like that. So I do kind of like that aspect of it. I'm not going to lie. Um, and lately I've been a little down and depressed with the whole drama with anacrylics and then my TikTok getting taken. I'm not allowing myself to go deep into a depression, but I mean, anyone that gets something taken away from them that they worked hard for, come on now, it's going to affect you. So, I had a pink drink earlier and I already had my tea. So for right now, I'm only drinking a little bit of water. I don't want to, um, I don't want to drink another cup of tea right now. Okay, so base coat is done. Okay, base layer is done. It's all ready to go. Next. So I already primed the inside of the XXL um, square nails. So the next thing I'm going to use is the squeezy gummy jelly. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to do, I like putting a little like on the nail, like just so that it connects. A little bit better I don't know I'm just weird like that I like to put a little that's wet I feel like it just sticks better for for some reason so um, usually when I use like a prey or anything like that I put a little bit of wet on here and then I also put obviously um, on the inside of the tip Okay, so like I said, I do have flatter nail beds, so I have to put a little more. And I want to try it the way he does it, um, Max does it, because he actually goes like this and slides it up. So I want to move this more right here because I put this on the edge and then I put it right there while it's on so that I put it on I put it for a couple seconds just to secure it and then after I'm done with all five fingers I put it into the lamp so that um it could be a full cure okay so I actually keep this on so let's try this I don't want all right So I know I will have to clean this up a little bit. I need to put this on the edge a little more. Um, but there is no bubbles, so no bubbles. I will have to clean up the edges a little bit, but I really like how easy that was. <laughs> okay, all right, so it's burning a little bit, so I know it's working, boom. All right, next. I think I'm actually not going to put it because with this, the way he slides it up, I feel like if I slide it up, it actually sticks out and gets it more messy. So I'm going to do it exactly the way he does it 
um this stuff is hard to get out but i'm gonna do it exactly how he does it because it seems like it works it seems like it works really well okay so he does it like right here and then slides it up oh my gosh this is way easier all right boom wow I get way less. So with me, sometimes when I do it, I have to take the e-file and go around because like gel comes out, like it comes seeping out. And with this, it didn't like, I'm like shocked. I do have one bubble on this one though, but it's okay. I'll cover it up. And I usually don't keep these on for very long. So it's not like, you know, I'm really needing these on for super long okay next i mean we're already on the third finger like what the gummy gel does take a little pressure to get it out so just be careful with that okay i want to make sure it's straight and then boom I like this gummy jelly. I think I'm going to buy more. Or I want to actually try his new pink stuff. I haven't got that actually. Um, my last package I bought from him was actually all gems and like goodies like that. So. Okay. Next. Next. Ooh. I want to record myself doing a little TikTok. Hey, baby. What are you doing, my little lover boy? I didn't know you were down here. My little baby's down here, and I need to get this out of his way. I'm sorry, baby. What? I love you. I got to get this on and I can't touch it because your hair will get on my nails. They're sticky right now. Okay. So, yeah, make sure you get it like all the way to the edge because when you slide it forward, you want to make sure that it slides and then goes forward, okay? All right. So, I, this is how I do it. I put some on the edge like that. You want to slide forward, like put it halfway down your nail, slide forward and get all the gel, make sure it's straight. And then I have the lamp right here on the edge of my table and that's it. Then you cure it for, woo, this one burns. You cure it for a couple seconds and then at the end, that's when you're going to put it in the lamp and do a full cure, okay? Okay. See how, oh my gosh, this is actually a lot easier than even using a prey. Why didn't I, I mean, this has been sitting over there and I've just been obsessed with like the Roxy from a prey. So it kind of like, but I'm going to try the new pink stuff that he has, the new pink gel. He does have it in clear also, but I really want to try the pink because I feel like it'll look really nice like a um extended nail bed. You know, when the gel goes forward, you know, when it goes out like that, it's going to cover the nail bed. Because I have ugly nail beds, personally, I think so, anyway. Because I bite them, so. All right, boom. This is so much easier doing it this way. It's, like, way less messy. Like, super easy. All right. All righty. Alrighty, now, since this is done, all five, all five fingers are already done, so I'm going to put it in the lamp for uh, 60 seconds. See, 
60 seconds. I'm super excited. <sighs> I brought out some colors from my little unicorn. I'm not really sure what I'm going to do yet, so we shall see. We shall see, we shall see, we shall see, we shall see. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 50 seconds. Oh, it stopped. <laughs> okay, let's check my phone while we have this going. Okay, so it was, it's done. It is enough. Alrighty. So, boom. I already got one hand done. Please tell me what system is faster than this. And don't get me wrong. I love doing nails. You know what I'm saying? I'm not saying that, you know, this is going to be the only way I do nails. Obviously, I love sculpting. So, you know, I, um... Wait, who? Oh, somebody just asked me if I needed it, if I could do a fill. Sorry, I just got this. Um, I don't go on Facebook ever. So I got to text them and say that. They need to, like, text me. I swore I gave them my number. Okay, anyway, so, boom. That is done right there. So, yeah? Oh, shit. No, I didn't. I started doing my nails and recording a video. I'll do it. Just let me do this real quick. I love you too. I love you. I'm sorry. I f completely forgot. I just was like, oh, I'm going to do my nails and do a video quick. <laughs> All right. Light is ready. Okay. So let's do like right here and then slide forward. Oh, no. I don't think I got enough on this one, but. Oh, no, 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 no. I don't want the nail. I think I messed this one up already. So let's just do it the old school way. All right. Yeah, it still works though. Okay. Boom. No bubbles. Everything's good. Okay. Look, no bubbles. So, I mean, you don't have to slide it, but I just wanted to do it like his new way and just see how it worked. And it, it works really well. You just have to make sure you get enough on there, though. So, I kind of skimped it a little bit. I think that was my fault. Um, but he does his so perfect. It's crazy. He could do it so quick and so perfect. It's like nuts how he does it. I don't want that bubble. Okay. And I'm just keeping the light on. I usually like click it on and off just so I don't drain the battery. But this is so quick that it's kind of pointless to keep turning it on and off. So I just keep it. All right. So, boom. We're already on the third. I mean, come on. Like, how long have I been recording and we're almost done already? Other than just like, you know, doing your design and all that. But that's on you. Like, you could literally just paint your nails you know, gel them or whatever you're doing and then be done with it You to do a simple, you know, to a, do a simple set. I really want to get the pink gel of his though. So I think I'm going to do it. 
I've been going back and forth like, oh, you know, Black Friday, Black Friday. But you know what? <laughs> Black Friday is too far away. I need the French. I want the black French tips. You know, um, I need them in my life. So I think I'm just going to do it and buy them. Because I really, really love the look of the black French. Like, it's just gorgeous. So... And I'm gonna, probably going to get like a white French too, just since I'm ordering. Alrighty. I mean, look how fast this is. What, baby? What do you want? I'm ordering us Chinese. I'm ordering us Chinese. What do you think? What do you think? I'm going to order us Chinese, boy. I'm ordering us Chinese, boy. I know. I'm almost done. You hate when I'm in this room. You love the fact that I haven't been in here in a while, huh? Okay, the pinky doesn't need a lot. Yeah, this is so simple. Like, I would be in here for like three, four hours doing my nails if I was sculpting. Especially this long, what? And then if I did it on TikTok, like if I, if I did it on live... You know, you're chatting, answering questions. You're not really focused. Like, when I do my nails by myself, I can do them pretty fast because I will, um, all right, now they're done. I will, um, like, jam to music and just, like, be in my own little world. But when I have to do it on TikTok, live, or YouTube, you know, you're answering questions. You're stopping. I have to, like, touch the screen to go back and see what people are saying. And, like, you know, it's just not as time efficient, you know? What, baby? What do you want? I got my nails back. Are you happy? Are you happy? Hmm? All right. I should probably start getting the Chinese uh, website on. <laughs> All right. And done. Got both hands done. And I've been recording for I don't know how long, but boom, already done. You know, like, come on. How amazing is this? All right, let's put this back. Let's get this out the way for now because I might do a part two because I have to go order Chinese and do all that. So I usually just take it and straighten them out, you know, obviously to get the little the little dots all right okay that quick and that is it all you have to do is just shape them up make sure that um there's no extras around it but look how quick these are done now I get to go order Chinese food, come back and design them. I just like them a little straighter, like squared. So that's why I just, and his files are really good too. I just like his whole company, like the aesthetic overall. I mean, if you're into pink, then, like, this is, like, the perfect company for you. Because everything is just super cutesy. So, it's like, how can you not like it? All right. So, they're squared up. I think I'm good. And then what I usually do is, you know, if you want to take an e-file or just hand file and just go around, make sure that there is no gel around um you know flush the cuticle a little bit that's all i do okay and that's it 
because then they'll look more sculpted, you know. You don't want that. I mean, if unless you want the press on look. I don't like the press on look. I don't mind actually having press ons on, but I don't want, you know, I want my cuticles to look nice and flushed. And there we go. And that's it. I mean, how simple can, how much more simple can you get, you know? But be on the lookout for the next video of decorating. You know, I'm not trying to make this video super long. I got to go and order dinner. And um, eat with my baby. So I shall do a second video and decorate these later. <laughs> Justin's in the background talking about that's right you know he comes first not gonna lie y'all come second my bad that's just how it goes my baby comes first so but yeah so that's it I mean if you want to change you know if you want it to but these are perfect so I don't need to um change the shape i don't need to touch them up they come absolutely perfect the only thing like i said that i'm doing is just going around the cuticle and obviously this is a lot quicker i usually do this with an e-file but like i said i'm trying to only use enel couture products today i might have to just get his um Maybe it'll go on sale for Black Friday or something. Maybe I will get his. Because I've always wanted to try his his file, his e-file. Because um, it's so freaking cute. Like, what? So, I've always wanted to try it. I just never did because I already had um, Belle and I already had the Young Nails one. So, I kind of jumped the gun and got the Young Nails one without really thinking into things i bought it before i was like even that good with doing nails uh i was just starting to get serious and actually wanting to practice because i did more like dip nails and i did actually poly gel for a little while so you know i don't i met i messed up by getting the young nails e-file is it a good e-file yes but I would rather something that's cute and pink. And I'm just being honest. Like, you know, theirs is just boring and boring, you know. And that's, that's, it's just a professional one, you know. And there's nothing wrong with it. It's just, I want something cutesy and pink. All right, let me dust my fingers off. Dust, 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 dust. Okay. And now I'm going to use a little alcohol and clean up. And that's it, babies. That is all. Look how quick that took. And that, I mean, this was with me bullshitting and doing a TikTok with it. And, you know, like, wait until you guys see the design and stuff like that. They're going to look so good. They're going to look like I sat here. For four hours sculpting them. Isn't that amazing? Ugh, look. What? Alright you guys. I shall go. I love you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Watch the next video because it will be the design. So I hope you guys are having a good day. Bye. Oh, and also with these, since they are gel, you don't have to put a base coat, but I personally do just so that they're thicker and more strength to them. Um, you don't have to. I just like a thicker apex. I like that look. So you don't have to put like a base coat. You don't have to. Sometimes I'll even do like a hard gel I'll actually put hard gel over it also. So that's up to you. These are customizable. That's why some people fill these up and use poly gel on them. They actually put poly gel on the top of them, hard gel, acrylic. I mean, you could, there is 
you can do anything with these. You don't have to keep them this plain. You can do whatever you want. I think I'm actually going to clean that up a little more right there. There's like a little gel that... This is why, you know, having an e-file is important because you could get that more precise. I got it, but that would have been done, you know, the first time around, you know. It would have been a lot easier. But, you know, I'm just trying to show you guys that you can do it without an e-file. You can do it with limited products. You don't have to, you know, have an e-file and stuff like that. Because I know e-files are expensive and not everyone can afford one. And I like showing um, the fact that you don't have to have an e-file to, um, to get things done. You don't have to, okay? You know, get it when you can afford it, but don't, you know, pay your bills. Don't be going. I actually, I'm going to slim this down a little bit. I know, you know, people want to do nails seriously and stuff like that, but pay your bills first. Okay. All right. But anyways, you know, just make sure that there's no gel around there. Clean it up or whatever, and then go in straight into design. The possibilities are endless with these okay so do what you want and that's that all right i love you guys bye peace